and it was like was he miming or something he would, he would, <laughs> no, no no you see you see, you see when you are talking to someone and yeah. then you are trying to remember something and you don't intend yes. to say it out loud do you know they are worse but then use. it comes oh, see, I, know, hmm. I know i know i know but they are worse to use. Yeah, so like, <laughs> like you are thinking it in your head yes. and then you say it without intending to say it. I think that is I think that is what I happens. I feel they should hire you. I feel they should hire you. No, 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 no. You I'm, no, I'm not no, justifying I, it. You're, no, you're not getting me. I'm but not justifying it. No, no, no. But, but it's, it's a beautiful explanation. I'm not justifying it. It's a beautiful it. explanation. He was not thinking aloud, right? He so was we, thinking it's aloud. unfortunate that we heard it. And you know, that's very unfortunate. No, but that you see, they're thinking aloud. They're thinking aloud, even if you are thinking aloud and you are thinking in that particular way, just shows what you really think about the person yeah right or yeah. what your thought pattern usually is yeah probably that there's probably a certain disdain yeah. you know mm-hmm. so <laughs> i don't know yesterday i was telling the that you know there are a lot of people who believe that dr matthew poku is a fine gentleman mm-hmm. that he's good that he has done a lot for people and when you get close to him you you and you get to know the man you would love him because you know he's such an affable character and all of that there are a lot of people who share those sentiments right mm. but from afar from afar those who are not close to him like those who are close to him are defending mm. right he will come across as you know he will have there will be this perception about a certain arrogance about him mm. because it is not for any reason that you're too for or say to, to you know the second when he was being unveiled sort to give him that advice you know and say all of those things yeah. and unfortunately we all know what happened when he mounted a podium later and he had to come out and apologize yeah. you cast your mind back to um when there was doom so yeah. and a journalist asked him a question about whether or not there will be a timetable you know yeah. he says we should do our own timetable why do we wish evil for the country yeah. you know and all of that so from afar when a lot of people are hearing you make these kinds of utterances mm-hmm. right mm-hmm. it will inform a certain perception and you cannot necessarily begrudge anybody for saying that you are an arrogant person even though it may not necessarily be the case, the case yeah. but then your, the utterances that you've made and the certain yeah. posture that you have sort of exhibited, yeah. maybe to you, that is not who you are. Or maybe to the people close to you, that is not actually who you are. Mm-hmm. But then because of these things and you've, you've not necessarily been too guarded about some of these things, it yeah. informs the perception. And when these blunders continue to happen, it continues to feed the perception that you're an arrogant person. Well, Lantam, um, just in a sentence or two, I think what Napo is suffering from is his inability to realize the condition he finds himself in now. Mm. What you just related to, relative to how he forgot the late Professor Melzer's name. Yeah. And then it's what you would do when you're having a conversation with your friends. Mm-hmm. An informal conversation. With informal your friend, conversation, yeah. With your friends, right? Yeah. Uh, in a bar somewhere, or you, you know, are taking a stroll. So yeah. you are I'm talking to you, like, I'm going to a friend. Yeah, yeah, yeah oh, exactly. I'm going to exactly. That kind of thing. But you don't say aqua <laughs> on the podium. Yeah, but he didn't say aqua, he said back on. You are not getting me. <laughs> You see, example, yes, it's an example. I know, I know. Yes. I'm just Th- these are conversations. That, yeah. oh, that, oh, Charlie, no, those things. Yeah. Informal yeah. um, b- b- friendship uh, b- conversation, bro, bro, bro conversation. Yeah, you don't do bro conversation on a on a podium. That's the point. When you are addressing, you know, your That's supporters. That's the point. You don't, and you it's, don't do it's that. happened one too many. Yeah. Hopefully, he learns sooner than later. Because instead of people focusing on what he's saying and what he's doing to probably help his flag bearer. There are many who also believe that he's dragging the flag bearer down. Yeah, the, yeah. The, there are those who may, because the flag bearer yeah. seems to be this, you know, very calm, cool, you know, gentleman. <laughs> and then uh, his, his running mate is also supposed to compliment the calm, cool gentleman yeah. as an ojacious person. Oh, okay. So I think that is where all of this is coming, coming from. from. Like, you know, the ojacious, well, you know. Well, L- Lantam, look, yeah, uh, uh, um, <laughs> if, if in the past I, I perceived Napo to be arrogant, mm-hmm. I think I'm beginning to revise my name. <laughs> I don't think he's arrogant. I think he... he He's a poor communicator yeah. Who, yeah. who doesn't realize, like I be said, the times he finds himself yeah. and the position he finds himself. Where and when to and say he, something. His, his communication also lacks strategy. Yeah. I'm saying this because, look, first of all, a lot of people believe that that even compares him. That even brought Nkrumah's name. Yeah. And the manner in which he said the name, give him issues, was needless. Yeah. I also think that this current one is also needless. Yeah. What does he seek to achieve 
with the mention of former presidents yeah. and what they've done, yeah. only to end with Ekufuado standing tall about all of them. But that's the end game. A, yeah, that's the end game. Yeah, I course. want to understand the political capital Napo thinks he can get yeah. from this kind of analogy. He's, pro he's, proje he's projecting. You, no, but the man is living. The man, the man you are projecting so, so is living. You you and many people will vote for your ticket yeah. because you are projecting the man who is living. Yeah. It's not enough that the man is there and then the man's existence will be enough for the person to vote for you. You trumpeting it is what will get you the vote. Yeah. Already, already, really? already, 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 to, already, already no, some key mm. promises that the same person that you seek to project above everybody yeah. has implemented. Yeah. You and your candidate say yeah. you revise it. Exactly. You get it. So you get the point I'm making. That is one. Now two. Napo is not only representing the MPP as a running mate. Yeah. Napo is also representing people who have been brought up from the palace, yeah. from Ahimfi. Yeah. In our local yeah. setting, when we say Obi Ahimfi, yeah. that person is so refined and polished that where that comes out of the person's mouth unifies people and yeah. not divide them. Yeah. And I think Napo is failing on that tangent. Yeah. Well, I, I just think he's trying to employ the political strategy mm -hmm. of, look, if we are going to vote for the MPP, look at the good work that this man, who is the leader of the MPP, or who was the leader of the MPP and became president, has done. His work stands tall. Okay. So imagine that you, you give the MPP another four years because this work that he has done, he has done with this man who is now the flag bearer. They've yeah. done it together. Okay. And when you look at the history of the Fourth Republic or maybe even the history of Ghana, this man's work stands tall. Okay. And so look at the work that has been done. I think that is the point that uh, Dr. Matthew Puku Prepper is trying to make. You are the only one, one getting this point. No, I think that's the point <laughs> he's trying to make. <laughs> <laughs> but but why, why did he stand on stage and say that, you know, uh, presidents being you are why yet I, to, are, I told you yeah. why because the president was not in support of his choice as a running mate so he was seeking to appease the president are you sure ah what else look are you sure? <laughs> sure. i've been in ghana for a while let me are predict you, what sure? happened <laughs> the president <laughs> let me let me tell you he's not supporting let me let me tell you let me predict what will happen in the coming days a group in the central region will call him out. Yeah. Demand apology. To apology. Yeah. And that will be the next destination for his campaign. Yeah. Just, he, just as he did in, 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 yeah. in Zima. Yeah. In Koranza. Yes. Yes. Well, I don't know if there are... Are, are there... Are there... Are there loud calls for an apology on this one too Not oh yet. it will come by it is it, it, now gathering momentum yeah he's just it starts prediction. with you trending on social media yeah then you trend in the real world world yeah. and that is where those demands yes. will be made yes so basically see the the point is simple uh i've when it happened the first time i said see it's a first one it's a learning curve i'll still repeat that the handlers of napo can assist a lot Sometimes these are not things you even script to. Yeah. These these are things you actually flee from mm. in political communication. Mm -hmm. It happened first. Comparison. It landed you in trouble because you added Mumfa Mumkromano. You went to Nkrofo to apologize. Yeah. You said you had been misconstrued. The chiefs forgive you. Mm -hmm. I think in my upbringing. The most prudent thing to do is to avoid that yeah. conversation. Yeah, yeah. Avoid it. No, but it's politics. You are not getting me. You have you to. You can project a kufu ado without yeah. necessarily having to bring others in. That you can't it. talk about three You can't yeah. talk about one district, one factory. You can't. No, that's the he point. That's the needless venture we are talking see, about. Some of the people. No, but, uh, you some of the people. That's some of the people that you are. Compared. You compare to Mahama. Uh, uh -huh. So who who are they fighting against? But have you forgotten that politics is a politics of comparison? You are not getting me. Who are they fighting against? Who is on the ticket? Is it not Mahama? Yes. It's a Kuma on the ticket. It's Atamos on the ticket. It's JJ on the ticket. It's JJ not dead. When you go to JJ, why didn't he say New Year 2020? No? Mm. And by the way, why are they all doctors? It was JJ a doctor. Oh, he was trying to give them reverence. What was was was, was Mills a professor or a doctor? He was. A, I'm saying these well, are. You can't become a you can't see, become a professor without be, being a doctor. No, no, but, but has, when yes, when you see, when see somebody who has earned his professorship, refer yeah, to the person as, as doctor, doctor and give the person but, this explanation and see where can, where, where that will land you. You can't, become, you can't become a professor if you are not a doctor first. That, that's the point. So yeah, why yeah. why why refer to the latter? So instead of so Doctor Mills is still doc. He has a doctor because oh. Professor Mills Prof Mills had a PhD. There was a point in time where Prof. Mills was he, Dr. He, he, in Apo, I'm sure. Prof. I'm sure. I'm sure. If he's well, on we'll a panel, we'll call Prof. Mills for you. Don't address them as doctors. If in Apo is on a panel and somebody comes see, referring see. to Professor Mills as yeah. Dr. Mills, yeah. he would disqualify the person. Exactly. See, see, <laughs> see, he said Dr. Rollins. Yeah. Dr. Rollins was Dr. He was. Uh, Rollins was. If you haven't, was given an honorary. Please, we don't. We don't. 
Now, 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 Flight Lieutenant Jerry John Rawlings yeah. was uh, was offered an honorary doctorate. No but you don't you don't you don't you don't, you don't, use, you don't use it. You don't Prof mention Mills. that when you're Prof addressing Mills. people. Yeah. Prof Mills. Was a PhD Prof holder yes. at the point. No yes. problem. I mean not at the point. He was always a PhD. After he had his PhD, he was a PhD holder. The PhD didn't go anywhere. <laughs> and then he became professor. Okay. Um was Jerry Kufo given an honorary doctorate? I believe he was. Uh, yeah, he was. He was. Yeah. yeah. So, so Dr. Dr. Kufo. Dr. Kufo. Okay. And then uh, uh, he Dr. didn't Moss. want. He didn't want to mention. Mahama. How you go to Mahama? Yeah. That was where he started laughing. He started laughing. He didn't yeah. want to mention. Yeah. Um, John Mahama's name. No problem. You, you have some sounds to play, <laughs> right? You play the sounds. As a you see, mm. others are always thinking about Mahama. Yeah, so oh <laughs> yes, so. <ooh>. Why? Why? <laughs> <laughs> this is the morning star. This is the morning star. You're listening to Star. 103.5 FM. We're live on Empire 102.7 FM. And we want to <laughs> make sure that you get to our Facebook page as well because we are streaming live on Facebook. Yeah, we are. Since January 2017 till date, i.e. in the Akufuado Mahama Baumia era. <laughs> <laughs> so, Mama has been responding. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it is interesting. Out of abundance of the heart, the mouth speakers. And so, when the president goes and he's talking about his administration and he says, Akufuado Mahama administration, oh, this is unpardonable. It means he dreamt about me the night before. <laughs> and it's not only him, even his chairman, Ashanti chairman. And so, uh, was he speaking to your English? So, everyone should vote for John Dramani. Hey. <laughs> he also dreamt about me that night before. We can read their minds from what they are thinking and what they are dreaming about. The time has come for us to take our destiny into our own hands. <laughs> yeah, they, they so like a side of politics. So Baba is trying to say that he's living inside their head rent free. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> but this one, he must pay rent. He must pay rent. Of course, this is, you know, you know, and, you know, I mean, <laughs> this is, this is interesting, you know. Uh, because of the way of the politics yeah. that we do in this country, some of yeah. these things are bound to, are bound to happen. Oh, we love yourself. Right. When you talk about something party over and over yeah. again, I was at the program. But how can you about who to be going and say that vote for John Dramani? I love him now. Yeah. <laughs> I, I was at and the then pro he pauses yeah. and then he corrects himself. Yeah. There's always that. <laughs> yeah. So, so I, 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 are they being prophetic? No, oh no, that's that's yes, 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 prophetic. Yes, yes, a blunder. See, I mean, if you yeah, win an election, it but doesn't have, have heard, to but be. But have you heard anyone? Have you heard anyone in the MPP do a slip of tongue and mistakenly call on some people to vote for anybody in NDC? NDC yes, in NDC to vote oh, for yeah, mistakenly yeah. tell anyone to vote for um, Dr. Baumia. Or, you know, trying to talk yeah. about President Tekufuado and I think, I think they went mentioned John Mahama instead. Let, 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 know, let, me, let, me, let me, I was uh, recently at the program like that. and something happened and uh -huh. I think that's, that's why. You see, Mahama and Mahamudu. Mm. Yeah. Mahama and Mahamudu. If you don't take care, you are very likely to mention one instead yeah. of the other. Yeah. It happened to the Ochehene, let me tell you. And, and uh, subsequently, you played that with you. Ochehene was the special guest of honor at the commissioning of the Royal Ghana Gold Refinery. Uh, he took to the podium and then he was trying to acknowledge the presence of the vice president and an MPP flag. Mm -hmm. He actually added John. He said, John, Maham, Ma, Ma, Mahamud <laughs> Baumia. <laughs> you, get, you get the point. So I could uh, automatically I could tell because he, it was the Mahama and the Mahamudu. Yeah, but he but added the John. The John, yeah. Exactly. Why did you add the John? Mahama is not called John. Uh, uh, Mahama Dubaumia is not called John. So where from the John? Yes, he's a Muslim. He doesn't have any, you know, Christian name. Yes, yes. So it happens, like <laughs> like you all said, it happens. So that that's basically that's the lighter side of politics for you. Mm. 
<laughs> yeah. It's interesting. <laughs> yeah. Uh, we've got the newspapers. Let's mm -hmm. get into the stories. <laughs> On the newspapers today, uh, the Daily Graphic newspaper. I'll build a prosperous nation. John Alan Kojo Chairman thing. This one. Yeah, he's, right, John. Right? he's yes, John. He's John. He's John. So yeah. um, he says, I'll build a prosperous nation. Um, present circumstance must influence your vote. That is Togbe Afede, mm -hmm. XIV, the 14th. Mm. The Agobomefia yeah. of the Asogli state. Yeah. Inflation is down. So inflation has been, you know, declining, declining. Yeah. Small, small, I think consecutively. Yeah. yeah, for the past four months or so, yeah, inflation has been coming down. <coughs> and now it's at 20.9% for the month of July. Food inflation has also declined, yeah. right? So uh, we want to see it reflect when we go and when we go to the market and we go and buy. And, and it's interesting you mentioned. It's interesting food you mentioned it because there are many people who actually believe that once inflation comes down, prices yeah. must come down. Prices must come That's down. That's deflation. Yes. Now, inflation in the layman's language is the rate at the which, rate at which is prices increasing. increase. Yeah. So now, if hitherto prices were increasing by twenty-one percent. Yeah. Now the rate of increment is twenty point nine. So forget about the point. So it will still twenty percent. It will increase by just that it will be by twenty percent until we go into the negative. That's deflation, yeah. and that will mean that prices have actually. Yeah, I want to see the prices of food in the market come down. Uh, not in Ghana, probably. Yes, not in I want Ghana, to see probably. the prices of food in the markets and the prices that we buy things come down. Yeah. I mean, inflation is a constant. Inflation is something which is a constant. Yeah, but right? some people have been experiencing deflation. Yeah, some people. Some have, people yeah. have their I think there was inflation a point also stagnated. Yes, yeah, so there was a point even in Japan yeah. where there was you know deflation you yeah. know, for some point. But uh, in, but inflation is a constant, right? Oh yeah, I get you. Um, prices of goods and services will always go will up. Always go up unless you build your economy in such a way that you can keep prices stable for exactly. a very long time. Exactly. Otherwise, you know, more often than not, inflation. Is, is a constant yeah prices always go up right true so inflation is at 20.9 percent for the month of july public lands secure that's according to the minister for lands and natural resources samuel abujanapo uh, he's assuring the nation that public lands are secure mm. quantum new gas committed to cylinder recirculation and guess what no our association, I don't know if you are members, but our association, yeah, the Ghana Journalists Association, mm. okay, is 75 years old today. Yeah, the GJA is 75 today. So yeah, yeah, yeah. Good, uh, yeah. Let us celebrate. Good morning, because, to because you were talking about cylinders and GJA. I thought you were coming to say they are giving every journalist a cylinder <laughs> or something <laughs> or a gas cooker. <laughs> what every journalist needs yeah. money is money. Nah, no problem. <laughs> if you need cylinder, you and need the money and, to buy and, cylinder. And housing. Uh, yeah, journalists. housing. Why yeah. do you guys need housing? So I'm journalists, gonna, so housing, I'm sleeping. Money, Affo money, affordable housing for journalists. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Uh, money because okay. money because you guys had one with Kwan Estate. What happened to that? I don't know, but <laughs> money because by and large, a lot of journalists are not very well paid in this country. The okay. media landscape, remuneration in the media landscape is poor. Uh, is it in the headlines? It's very poor. Yeah, DJ is DJ. No, the yeah. no, no, it's DJ. So members of DJ. Uh, now uh, this is advocacy for members. Advocacy of uh, for me, members I'm not a member, so you uh, guys. Yeah, so, advocacy yeah. for members of you know, DJ. There was a, there was an attempent to no, form another you, one. Professional journal. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, but whether or not you are not a member, you are a journalist. And once you are a journalist, if anything happens, the GJ will come to your come to your 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 aid. No, 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 no. The things that have happened. Because they are there, even though there are registered members who pay dues, but every journalist out there, the GJ is interested. Your well being, ah, no freedom problem. association. The man says it's not part, yeah. Maybe no, actually, maybe it's part of another if professional any, body. If anything happens to you right now, the GJ will step in. No, on your behalf. I have step, 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 step I, I, in as well. I, I, I belong to so many other groups, yeah. Don't worry, yes. Parliamentary, press parliament, press yeah. He's <laughs> a member of parliamentary press corps, don't worry. Don't and worry. Uh, parliamentary journalist association. Why, why, why must you wait for something to happen to me? <laughs> but now, like, <laughs> the parliamentary correspondents <laughs> is part of ECOWAS. Uh, it's part of AU uh, Parliamentary uh, Correspondent Association. Don't worry, don't worry. EU. Uh, yes. NATO. Uh, parliamentary <laughs> Correspondent. So the man The finish. point is there is a Ghana Journalist Association. Yes. Yeah. Ghana. Ghana Journalist Association 
is interested in the well-being of every single they should bring Ghanaian me breakfast they should bring me breakfast no, regardless <laughs> of whether or not you are a registered member and paying dues uh, so uh, now now, now we are now now okay me i'm saying we because yeah okay maybe i'm part yeah of gg yeah i'm saying that yes. okay so now what what becomes of the bargaining certificate I, i'm yeah. telling you that this thing yeah. i remember yeah. i was sent to that assignment to to that press center yeah when I felt money was yeah for, what, for, for better remuneration yeah exactly. that now yeah, DJ so is like part of TUC, TUC blah 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 yeah. they came with the TUC I think the other one is it Kofia Samoa uh, yeah yeah yeah, yeah, yeah came yeah, with yeah. him and all yeah. those people was, with a certain certificate what has become of it because yeah. you see so I was we are part of point. TUC yeah then there should be that collective effort to yeah. ensure that we are paid well exactly yeah, what has become of it so please the current DJ should tell us. What has become of that bargaining certificate yeah. and where we stand yeah. with regard to 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 unionization yeah, or where we sit things. because we can't always be standing yeah so where we sit or sleep <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah 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 and i was i was coming to that point that is why i was talking about the poor remuneration yeah you know within journalistic circles mm -hmm. right a lot of media houses uh the remuneration is poor you know for the journalists to go out there and the journalists are always putting their lives at risk to bring you the stories. Well, are you an Af are you an Afghanistan? Am I? <laughs> are you an Be there. <laughs> when when you the last time you went to cover the demonstration and they were flying, you were running for cover. Yeah, uh, I remember. No, in fact, there was a by election. The, Tell us the by election. You were running for cover. Tell the bullets were flying and we were running and I was on air, right? So then you, you, were, you, were, you were running for cover. That is, they, they, but you were dead. No, I was covering war. You were, that has made me a veteran. Yeah, so you were. <laughs> if you had not been there to report what was happening, you know, the people who were listening would not have known. You put yeah. your life in danger. Yeah, that's true. So you should be remunerated by DJ. Not by DJ, <laughs> by your employer. <laughs> and DJ, DJ must compel your employer. To, to give you good remuneration. Yeah. So I'm coming with sometimes. Plus can't bonuses. Sinate, yeah. Maybe this can't, I can't sinate, just call me the owners and say, ah, but you this 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 <laughs> this 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 rate you are paying. No, no, but it's this is you are paying like, as like, you call and to you now this rate that you are paying as contribution you for see, your work. It could give you, it could give you. <laughs> you see, you see, we are laughing at we are laughing about it, but it's but, but, serious. But, but we have we, to laugh. Okay, we do. Why should we why should we you see but it's serious? But Lantan, but we are paid well. Because there are that you are paid well. Yes. See, I am paid well. Don't see me. Like that, the point is, the point is, if no, you are paid well. No, 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 get people employed yeah they send them out there on assignment they don't and instead of them don't, paying they them, don't pay them they don't pay them anything yeah, that's what i'm and coming they to tell them that they have a platform can you go to antimony and use that platform and use the platform to buy watch yeah yeah you, you get a point that's exploitation so I, I get how that much but, but as to how much you are paid i think it's up to you the individual mm -hmm. you see some of us journalists too we we undervalue ourselves mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. we don't stand up because it's all about negotiation and the value you place on yourself. To be honest with you, if journalists worth their sort can stand up and say, this, if I don't get this, I'm working. If I don't do this, I think the landscape will change. We were here talking about how EIB yeah. changed the landscape yeah. by of how journalists are treated in some other media houses. Yeah. Because if you blink, others will come and put your best hands. Mm -hmm. And it, we cannot say that the landscape today is the same as 10 years ago or is the same as 20 mm. years ago. Mm. But there's more room for improvement. Mm. That's the point I want to make. Room for room everywhere. I mean, lectures, oh, yes. lectures are even exactly. about much. Exactly. Thing. Yeah, I mean, and it's bad. You know, when you hear that journalists are, are paid, people who are journalists in today, 2024, are yeah. paid as little as, you know, 400, 500. 600, 700. No, those yeah. ones are like a lot ones. For, no, people's pay. And there are Else, those, elsewhere. There are there those, those who, who don't pay at, at all. all. Like what IB was saying. Yeah. We are, but we you are see, giving you the how platform. are those people... You, I think you has a lot of work to do. Look, you know? How are, how are, how are these people surviving? Uh, Oku, yeah. Okum Chola. Do you know Okum <laughs> no, Chola? No, Papa Kwa. Yeah. Do, do, you know, do you know Okum Chola? Yeah. It's a miracle. It's a miracle. Anyway. Thank you. That's how they are surviving. Uh, you, you, are you done with the Daily Graphics? Yes, uh, I'm on the back page of the Daily Graphics. See something, see something campaign intensifies in the Upper East region. And Talogana hands over 180 bed dormitory to Methodist Senior High School. So, yeah, that's the Daily Graphic. Okay, so the Guardian Times this morning. Alleged land grabbing by political class. We will publish list of public lands. Lands minister promises. It says public lands safe. 
intact, secure. And you understand why it's very necessary that the lands minister speaks to this. Mm. Because the indigents in Accra think that the yeah, people are, in people are power grabbing are their just lands. sharing their lands yeah. like confetti. <laughs> yeah. Mm. Kolebu, right now you need to resume outpatient services next week. Charlie, they should make up their minds already. We heard, we told why is it today we so, so so yesterday on monday yeah. we, were, we were told that oh yeah. by tuesday yeah yeah then yeah. tuesday yeah we were told that oh by wednesday yeah now so yesterday our reporters went there yeah and we are told that of course the consumables are in yeah but full operations will begin next monday. week they've yeah. just we been should, able to we should, we should always bear in mind <laughs> that it's a people's life that we're, we're talking, talking about. about yeah yeah and we told that uh, guy the health ministry says it's going to procure 30 New dialysis machines. You see, the issue with no, the consumables is that I don't get it. So, like, when you are using the things and you are running low yeah. on consumables, no, don't they you couldn't see? clear them taxes? Uh-huh. That's the conversation. They could not clear them. They couldn't clear taxes. them. Yeah, they were so there, they locked up, sitting there and, yeah. for a long time, sitting there, <laughs> and money to clear the goods were yeah. there. Yeah, yeah. Charlie, Ghana can happen to anybody. Oh, oh, yes. Uh, and if you look at, uh, <laughs> yeah. have, and I don't understand why that is always a problem for the health. Like, what is happening in the health ministry with regard to clearing of... Because no, this, free, no because, this one there's no free. Because, this one, they had to pay yes, the taxes. Because even the global fund, you know, also oh, yeah, sent, yeah. you know, yeah. so many... Even the free ones, they're the not able to clear. There. Yeah. The ones that they have to pay to that... And Lantam is raising a very valid point. Is it the case with every state agency that clears goods? Ah. Do they all encounter similar, problem? similar problems? Is it somebody at the health, health ministry, ministry who's yeah. sleeping on his job yeah. for each reason? Yeah. All their essential items are, yeah. are not cleared on Everything time. We are not able to clear I think, the, I think, the things yeah, I think it's, it's What's happening important. at the health ministry? Like and that, that ministry, what's too, what's unfortunately, there? they don't find themselves accountable oh, to yeah. anybody. Look, yeah. they are behaving like the police service. Now, their public relations unit, they don't grant interviews. They don't talk. The Ministry of Health. So they are the second police service. Lantam, do you know the duration of a dialysis session is four hours. Mm-hmm. Four hours. Yeah. Now, on the Kol- average, Kol- yeah. Kol- 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 has uh, f- just five so far. Five. And the five is f- for both inpatient and, and outpatient. outpatient. But uh, the 30 that you talked about, I thought the 30, because no, yesterday, they are not, they, no, no yesterday we were told that 30 machines yeah, have they been are from, it's procured. procured. Yeah, yes. yeah, they are not no, in it, right? Heard, we, are yet, we are yet to yeah. start yeah. using right. yeah. I mean, they are yet you to. See? So at least, and then you, you need one on standby because there can be an emergency. So imagine that all the five are occupied and it has to take four hours and that's an emergency. Whose own do you disconnect <laughs> to go and then attend to the emergency? Mm. Charlie, the things that can kill you in this country, eh? yeah. they are many. But I'm happy about the 30 that are Oh, yeah, yeah, of course. That's good. Very news. happy. Uh, that's good because if we have only five at Kolebu and now yeah. there are 30 more that are coming. Yeah. Uh, that's good news, uh, but yeah. I think we can do more. I was also asking, you know, how far we are with permanently putting dialysis on the national health insurance scheme. Some yeah. respite was given, and yeah. so some of the dialysis cost, yeah. you know, for certain categories of people yeah. uh, have been catered for, yeah. right? Yeah. Uh, so at least your cost, you know, has been halved. But I mean, that's still the end of the year. Yeah. So well, that, from yeah. when it ends, you know, yeah. how far are we with regard to properly considering putting? Yeah. Dialysis permanently on the national health insurance. The, the way scheme. to go is to set setting up a fund, and I think the politi- politicians have taken it up. I think I've seen it in one of some of the promises that the politicians are making, mm. because it's very capital intensive. I'm talking about uh, kidney or renal treatment. Uh, nowhere can you put renal cost of renal treatment on a social health insurance scheme. You can't. The scheme will collapse. Mm. Even as it stands now. And there are many people who are questioning the potency of the drugs you are giving when you go to hospital with a health insurance card, right? And so what can be done is what was done for Cardio Thoracic Center, yeah. where we had the Heart Foundation, yeah. a fund, the setup. Uh, government put something in. Uh, philanthropists can equally do same and corporate organizations. That's what we ought to do. Then you draw from that fund to cater for uh, those who cannot afford dialysis treatment. Yeah. Putting this on Ghana Health Insurance Scheme, the National Health Insurance Scheme, will be the final nail in the coffin. And then we must also pay attention to the conditions that predispose predispose us to renal disease, lifestyle, yeah. what you eat, what you drink. It's a big thing that I think government can take up. Non-communicable diseases, yeah. awareness creation, mm-hmm. what you have to consume, what you don't have to consume, and what yeah. have you. We are not doing so well in that regard. But as a young person, as a young man, as a young woman, you must be careful what you put in, what you ingest. Definitely. Yeah. The coke is too much. Yeah. 
Coke, energy drinks. People drink. are drinking too many yeah. energy drinks. But why, yeah. why you, why you, yeah, say the soft drinks or those, yeah. but why you mentioned oh, no, the, yeah, the, the other one? Someone, yeah, the other yeah, one. Yeah, the the other Coke one. can be the, the yeah, 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 I get you. Yeah, it's the other it's one. unfair yeah, the other one. The other yeah. ones. I mean, the, yeah. the, 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 the soft drinks. The fizzy and caffeinated drinks. Uh-huh. Fizzy drinks and caffeinated drinks yeah. are too much. Yeah. Yeah, they are too much. Yeah. So we need to cut down. I mean, if you drink them occasionally, I mean, yeah. occasionally you grab a can and then you drink it, but it shouldn't be something which is uh, which is constant, right? Yeah. Take good care of yourself. Mm. Uh, haven't we been promised free checkup? Yeah, uh, We've been yeah, yeah, free yeah, checkup. yeah, yeah, yeah. F- on the on the books of the national yeah, health insurance. National health insurance. Yeah. We've been promised free yeah, checkup. Yeah, yeah, that's good. But you see, the checkup can only tell you that when is you have a problem. When is so the check? When is be- the checkup before- starting? Once a year, we but the checkup, they need to tell you when they say you have to be a cabinet member. It's not, and it's not, it's, yeah, <laughs> it's, it's not every checkup. Ca- yeah, Obviously, yeah. they are not going to check your, your kidney. No, it's a general, general one, one yeah. your BP and yeah, all those things. Checkup. But yeah. I'm saying that people themselves should also have their kidneys and those things, I yeah. mean, essential organs, tested or checked periodically because sometimes that is the safest way oh, to, yeah. To, yeah. To, to treat yourself or, yeah. or prevent yeah. um, serious complications. Wow. Nis is listening to us uh, from Takwa. He says, my mom does dialysis two sessions per week. Two, Are wow. two sessions yeah. per week. Two sessions In fact, week. you actually need three. You are supposed three. to do three sessions a week. Yes, but That's at least... how many you are supposed to uh, do. Depend if, because they avoid ingesting or eating certain things because that's what brings about impurities in your mm. blood that will have to be drained and what have you. Two can be enough. Now listen to this. She does it at the International Maritime Authority Hospital in Tema. And a session cost 941 Ghana cities. So almost 2,000 cities a week. A week. Chale. A week. Chale. A and month uh, will be... Wow. And she says, Chale. she says, shout out to her sister, big sister, Sister Sarah, who has been mm. footing the bill Chale. for the that's mother. O- that's almost 8,000. In a month. Just I'm not adding transportation. Yeah. But I had transportation and the and other things that, that That, that is this, like 10,000. And this is the plight of a lot of dialysis. Yeah. Yeah. When you listen yeah. to Balfour, the yeah. president of the Renal Pain Center yeah. Association, yeah. that's why a lot of people die because yeah. you can't keep it up. And Kolibu can't cater for everybody. So the other private facilities that have dialysis machines that people go, this is how much some of them are paid. Yeah. That is why it is important for us to have these dialysis machines coming and even more to make it more accessible. Yeah. That's why we need to get it onto the National Health Insurance Scheme yeah. in one way, shape, or form yeah. to make it more it accessible. Wow. Right? Yeah. Wow. So and, and this mother is 72 years old. Wow. So, wow. Charlie, kudos. Kudos to the family. Yeah, kudos to the family. For being able to put this. Yeah. yeah. Uh, Charlie, almost mother. Then the 8,000 a week. Yeah. Yeah, That Charlie. is huge. Yeah, and, and, and we are told Sandy is listening to us, uh, she's, uh, and tells, tells us that aside the cost we have just mentioned, there are some medications that the patient will have to be on and some lab tests that you have to do weekly. Mm-hmm. So aside the dialysis session, yeah, that that's why I said about. other things, if you combine wow. other things, you may, you may end up spending close to 10000 wow. The, the cost might 000. kill you yeah. rather than the disease. The cost has killed a or lot the of condition, people. Yeah. The cost has killed a lot of people, right? And there are some because of the cost. They are doing dialysis once every two once. weeks. Yeah. Some some are Once not even doing it at all because weeks. they can't they can't. Yeah, I mean those people who are not doing it, I mean they've just left themselves yeah. to because yeah. they can't afford. Mm. Yeah. So it's an important issue, and uh, it's not for any reason that we always continue I mean, I to highlight it. Yeah. So the final one here, Kolebu. Okay, the Tada Waves wreck Avocat Shama. About one thousand houses affected. I see on verge of wiping out Anglo Beach community. Residents call for urgent attention, and Ghana Health Service heightened surveillance to detect Mpox cases. Uh, to, uh, this country there uh, w- every month one disease outbreak or the other now mm. it's mpox yeah. that sounds like an app <laughs> 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 so that, back page of the times ghana nordics call for reforms in un security council and asphalt overlay on obichi bill lamp team progresses steadily that is it for the Ghanaian Times. The Daily Guide is what I have. And public land safe, secure, according to Lands Minister Jinapo. Also, release provisional voter register to NDC. And that's the demand that the largest opposition party is making. And Ghana will be better under my husband. Samira Baomia is making this assurance or giving this assurance. And you've transformed yeah. policing in Africa. Major General David Taluvu retired to Dr. George Ekufu Dampari, the IGP. And WHO declares monkeypox global health emergency these are the least stories in so that's the mpox mm. monkeypox monkeypox yeah. so um uh, daily dispatch mohammed's free shs for first year students will be 
reviewed NDC MP contradicts Mahama. No, so Mahama's face is just forward. So let me read the story. Dr. Clementa Park, mm -hmm. uh, we know he's ranking on the education committee, right? Mm -hmm. So uh, the member of parliament for Bursa South and deputy ranking member on the education committee, uh, Dr. Clementa Park says that the implementation of free academic fees for first year students will be subject to review. This comes after the flag of the NDC uh, said all of this. So um, speaking on the AM show, Mr. Park allayed fears of all concerned individuals. According to him, if challenges arise after the policy's implementation, an NDC government would assess the situation and make the necessary adjustments. How is that contradictory? Um, well, <laughs> I don't know about the headline. The headline <laughs> says, Mohammed's Free SHS for first year students will be reviewed. But I think what Dr. Clementa Park is trying to say is that, yes, we'll implement it. Yeah. Every policy <laughs> is subject to review. So if along the line you yeah. find the problems with it, we'll review it and then deal with the problem. That's essentially what Dr. Clementa Park says. But the headline makes it look as though he says, Oh, Mama says we'll give free uh, tertiary uh, tuition fees for level 100. But again, Clementa Park came and said that, Oh, like we are going to review that particular yeah. policy. Anyway, oh. coming. So that, that yeah. is the explanation. Yeah. Um, who wins the Okaikwe seat in the Greater Accra region? Is it Miss Theresa Awuni, who is the NDC <coughs> MP, or is it Nana Ama Dukua? Mm. But okay, we have so many Okaikwe, so which Okaikwe oh, is he referring to? That's Okaikwe North. That's what I mean. If you're not specific, yeah. how yeah. will people know yeah, the yeah. Kai Okaikwe North? Yes. Mm. Yeah. There's also Okaikwe Central, right? So that's it for the Lady Dispatch newspaper. All right, so Daily Post this morning. Vice President Baumia now speaking like an opposition leader because he has failed, says Mahama, on day two of vote, day two of voter regional tour. Uh, Japadie Togbe Afede confirmed CB Mafia have gone after his businesses. Uh, less in 2024, NDC demands the release of provisional voters register. Uh, the EC says on the 16th of this month, mm. the provisional register will be made available. Mm. That is yeah. tomorrow. 16th, yes, that's tomorrow. Yeah. So you go and check your name. No, to the political to the party. parties. Okay. I mean, my name is in. I voted in 2020. But they are so doing the exhibition of the uh, voters' register. So we check your name. Take my name out. I think they are starting on on Tuesday, right? No problem. I think yeah. they are starting the voters' yeah, those, uh, I think exhibition. That on mainly Tuesday. those who just got their names onto the electoral. Yeah, 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 yes, yeah. but of course it doesn't hurt. It doesn't hurt to go and check, check and see if your yeah. name is there. We submitted our names for special voting. Yeah. The EC decided to add another layer that we should go to the district office ourselves to go and then confirm. If I had time. Will I submit my name to vote in a special <laughs> voting? I didn't go. So they took our names out. No problem. We'll vote on election day. Simple. Yeah, simple. We'll vote on election day. Because we, we have submitted our details to you, indicating that we are journalists. And in the we past, that has always been the case. Yes. And I then you said we should rather easy. stop whatever we are doing. Like, I shouldn't be here. I should go to Amasamai. And then go and then let the people know that me, I am Ibrahim al Hassan. Where the details you have depict a, a different know, person or something but anyway but that's what they chose to do so many people who submitted their names could not have their names captured on a special voting list who we'll vote on election day if you don't worry <laughs> yeah so <laughs> the other headlines here oh i think that's it that's all right for the, post. the new crusading guy newspaper ga ga is mc slammed by residents for failing to investigate corruption allegations government committed to protecting public lands according to land Lands Minister and government establishes foundation for job opportunities. Baumia and Takpom family commence Titus Glover for helping to demolish unauthorized structures in Dodowa Forest and how Akumsen inspects strategic projects in Kaswa. So, those of you who mark Kaswa, they are key strategic, strategic projects in that area. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, Daily Statesman newspaper Callable to receive new dialysis machines. Mahama unhappy with voter region over MPP's growing popularity Amayawe Kumfi urges MPP to revise campaign strategy hey, Amayawe Kumfi it's been a while since we heard from Professor, uh, Professor Christopher Amayawe Kumfi that's Minister name. for Education that's name yeah Professor Christopher Amayawe Kumfi those were the days uh, we were chewing names of educational ministers that, that name oh no ministers of ministers state ministers of state yeah, yeah. yeah. know your ministers yeah know your ministers know your ministers Professor Christopher you can't forget, you can't Kumfi. forget that name yeah. You can't forget that name. Yeah, but it's not the owner of a Confidius. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I'm beginning to remember some other ministers yeah. uh, who have come and gone and where they... Where, where is Tony, yeah. Tony Aidu? 
Tony, Tony, Tony is around. Yeah, he, he was not well yeah, at the point, no. but he's, he's okay now. I think my mama met a few of them. Back, I mean, back, the, those the yeah. veteran in Back then, he used to be very active, eh? very, to, very. To to be quite. To be quite. Yes. Yeah, all of them were there. You know. Then we had. Uh, an IGP Peter Namfuri. Peter Namfuri. You can't. You can't. Was IGP? I think yeah. uh, two thousand. Yes. Shake Icy Quay. Shake Icy Quay. Where is he? He's around. He's around. I, I around think there. Peter Namfuri was the last IGP under under and, Rollins. Under Rollins, yeah. 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 Ni or kind of Adam of you. Yeah. 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 <laughs> Well, Interesting. Well, well, those yeah, names. Yeah, Charlie, yeah, Charlie, yeah. Charlie, Charlie. Interesting. Anyway, um, you done? You done? Uh, so I'm on the Daily Statesman newspaper now. Kolebu to receive. I've already said that. Okay. So public lands well protected under the So that's, uh, that's it. That's it for Daily Statesman. The final one I have is a chronicle. State land capture tag is politically motivated. Jinapo. Campaign on prudent... Uh, Campaign on prudence, not populism. IFS urges government, NPP to launch manifesto of lies, and of course you have you have a date with I, I, IFS later this morning. Yes, yes, yeah, yes. They yes, are yes, equally yes, cautioning yes, government yes. Uh, about, uh, in essence, celebrating ahead of time relative to economic recovery. Mm. NPP to launch manifesto of lies. Uh, that's according to Mahama. Yeah, so former president is saying that whatever promises the NPP will be making in the manifesto could have been implemented in the past eight years. Right? So, uh, to him, uh, there's nothing else to look forward to. But of course, uh, what do you expect from an opposition leader? <laughs> anyway, so, quotation for this morning, Exodus 23.1, you shall not spread a false report. You shall not join hands with a wicked man to be a malicious witness. So says the Lord. Don't bear false <coughs> reports. Yeah. Do Don't not. join hands with the wicked man. Yeah, wicked, 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 wicked. To 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 do co concern. No, the the, the, the rest of people they call wicked people Babylon. 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 But Babylon. when you go to Nigeria, then you saw Babele. <laughs> 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 the inside newspaper <laughs> is the final one I have and Fidel Castro, a life of revolution. You can read about him in the Insight newspaper. Also, how Ekufuado's government looted Ghana, Ghana through COVID-19. Manasi Azure's new book reveals. And danger, Ghana Health Service warns public over spread of dengue fever and mpox is declared public health emergency. Farmers in tears over huge post-harvest losses as WFP estimates Ghana's annual losses at 19 1.9 sorry billion US dollars and public notice land commission to cancel or expand land registered by or die in tow family of Accra beyond their 1904 boundaries. Story on page three of the inside newspaper. Yeah, All right. So, talking so, about the ministers, uh, yeah. Jeff is sending Kojo Barredu. Yes, Kojo oh, Barredu. Uh, another yeah. very popular yeah. minister Kojo for finance. Barred. Kojo Barredu. I think he, he for Kojo Barredu, it's, it's interesting how he started as education. And later move move to finance. Yeah, you remember yeah. when Osaf Mafo was moved yeah. from fi finance? Yeah, yeah. yeah. I think he, he died as the. You remember the chief yeah. of staff, um, PNE Kofor's chief of staff? Yes. Oh yeah. Yeah, President Kofor's chief of staff. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> yeah. 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 Know your ministers. Yep. Know your ministers. Know your I, th ministers. I think Roll Rollins' chief of staff was Anato Dazi. Anato Dazi, yeah, yes, Anato Anato for a very long time. For a very, very yeah. long time. I think he was the longest serving chief of staff until. Yeah. Uh, for for he started with, with Jake Obiche Bilam. Obiche Bilam. And yeah. then yeah. he became uh, MPNI. 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 Yeah. 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 Uh, uh, Mills maintained her remand in human throughout. Yes. And then, uh, yeah, throughout. Yeah. And then, of course, we know Mahama No, Professor Bani. Professor Bani at the point. Oh? Professor Bani at the point. Yeah, at the point. Yeah. No, Prosper Prosper was under Mahama. Eh. No, we, we need to clarify. We need to clarify. I think, but no, I think, I think, I think Julius Zebra. Of course, it was Julius Zebra. And remember, the new man was maintained by Mills throughout. I yeah. don't know if okay. after. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Okay. I get you. I get you. I get you. Anyway, interesting. Yep. No, know your ministers. Know your ministers. Know your ministers. Know your ministers. Richard Anani. Richard Anani. Another name. Another name. <laughs> yes, another <laughs> name. Richard Anani. Anytime I hear Richard Anani, you know the name that comes up. No. And a boss man because of that yeah, that, yeah, that, yeah, that, yeah, that, yeah. that that ruling and by, by yeah, Shraj yeah. that was later Anaba, contested yeah, in court. Yeah, and a boss man. Charlie, but, but things have happened in Ghana. Things have power. happened in Ghana. I think one, th one Thursday we should do political throwback. Throwback. Political yeah. throwback. Yeah. Look at first yeah. finance. Today is actually Thursday. Yes. Thursday. So that's so what we are. We are that's what we are doing. In that's why we are trying to remember. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We are remembering the old, the old very popular ministers, Adokofo and Co. Yes, Adokofo. 
I'm a Benua do at a point for yeah for NDC. Yeah, she be, she became very popular in NDC. Yeah. In fact, mm, mm. I'm a Benua do Ufuswampo for Baba Jamal. If you are this, Sanga Hanelli carried NDC back from opposition. But there's government. another man who, <laughs> for me, I think I think the allegations about um, gold and yeah. all those things caused him. Yeah. But one guy that I was looking forward to him being honored was Chumesi Apia. Chumesi Apia. You remember Chumesi yes, Apia? Yes, Look at the point. For the Bunu and yeah, there, at the yeah. point you hardly get an NDC representative on an account speaking Sp speech. Speech, yeah. And I remember as a child, I always used to listen to Chumisi yeah, Apia. Yeah, that's, yeah. that's true. Yeah. That's true. Yeah. Chumisi yeah. Chumisi Apia, I, I think that allegation really yeah. caused yeah. caused, yeah. caused him politically. Yeah. Because, yeah, yeah. In fact, his communication. There's this guy. There's Ohenba. Yeah. Ohenba on Oman FM. Don't, whenever I look at Ohenba, I see Chumisi. Yeah. Chumisi, Chumisi Apia. Chumisi Apia in there as well. Yeah. Yeah. Anyway. Yeah. Uh, it's a throwback. It's a throwback. So uh, it's a throwback. Your, to your minister. Yeah, and then for ministers of education, I remember uh, Christian Amakunyama. Yeah, as well, right? Yeah, those days, those days, Charlie. What about Christian? Christ, Christian Churchill. Christian Churchill. Yeah. 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 Christian Churchill. Yeah. Churcher? Yeah. I remember. Of, I remember of, her. Of, of blessed of memory. Blessed yeah. memory. Yeah, blessed yeah. memory. Yeah. 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 Uh, who else? Who else? Who else? Who else? Um, who was your days. favorite minister? No, not that, the, and, 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 and names that got stuck with us. Yeah, I know. But yeah, was names that got stuck. I never had one. Yeah, well, I really didn't yeah, care yeah, what they yeah, did. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't yeah. have a favorite minister now. No, I yeah. don't. I really don't care what they do. Uh, you don't yeah? have a favorite minister. Maybe, no, maybe, maybe, maybe the person will be minister. popular. No, I don't. And then they, I'll have easy recall. But they, because of the work I do, yeah, 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 I interface with almost all of them. No, I don't have one, my brother. Former former minister for parliamentary affairs. Jose Chimensa. Because he's a man in parliament. Talking about Jose Chimensa, I think Eugene Entry. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yes. He's been working on his own spiritual yeah. campaign. Yeah, I mean. yeah. Yeah, what happened relative to Afenio's um, ascension and what have you. But you, you always know that Eugene will have something to say. Yeah, he lost yeah, his seat. He's a renegade, yeah. though. Yeah, he lost his seat. And, and there are stories. Yeah. That people don't talk. I mean, just are, that people don't talk. There are stories. There yeah, are stories. stories. You know, what is scary? He he, he wants that if, if the governing party loses the election, yeah, that is when a lot of the issues will suffer. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I mean, I mean, it may before, not be pleasant. Before, before yeah, anything to. we see happen actually happens, the kind of things that goes on behind the scenes before yeah. it actually you know comes yeah. out that this decision has been taken or this has happened. Yeah. I mean, our politics, Charlie, yeah. in some way. Yeah. Yeah, so basically, wait. it is what it but is. Anyway. Uh, Starfm.com.gh. Yes, uh, starfm.com.gh. When yes. you log on to, uh, we're reminding you also to go to our Facebook page uh, at Star1035 FM and go to our hey, X page. So, Charlie, well. so, so uh, we are talking since the is alive. Yes, yes. So, <laughs> thank you, Dr. Jonathan Asante. So, Christian is alive. So, she's from the central region. Yes, yes, she is. Yeah, no, but. <laughs> <laughs> ah, where's Anita the Soso? Anita, Anita, Anita is wrong. Where Anita is wrong. Iti e Mensa, yeah, of course. Uh, Fred was also talking about Iti yeah, e Mensa, e former Mensa. minister, yeah, e the late, yeah. Enoch yeah. Enoch Mensa. Mensa. Yeah. And then uh, Edil Blanson. Yeah. Edil Blanson was the Akrame, former Akrame, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Many others. Oh, but you do, do, you, guys, uh -huh. do you guys remember? <laughs> <laughs> not, 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 not for, for his choice of who he decided to marry, yeah. but Professor Phoebe. You remember his vetting? Professor Dominic Phoebe, no, yes. Do you remember that vetting? Yeah. Who was asked to <laughs> recite the National Pledge and couldn't? Yeah, that was Professor <laughs> Phoebe. <laughs> <laughs> and that was done by Abba Magwin. The, what Abba Magwin did in Parliament, <laughs> eh? <laughs> Ha! But those days, yes, they, you could you could feel and sense maturity yeah. Yeah. across. Yeah, yeah. across it, politics was not just play. Yeah, yeah we can't see him now. Play. No, 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 we can't see him now. Now there are a lot of uh, <laughs> people <laughs> doing all kinds of things Charlie, Charlie, Charlie. in the name of politics. Yeah, we, 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 yeah. We, 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 allow us. We the people we can do what we want. Even yeah. even senior MPs are ruling on motions. <laughs> 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 yes, yes, yes. Niyomo don't call former health minister as well. Yeah. Uh, Niyomo don't call. And then many others. All right, so are you at starfm.com.gh? I am at starfm.com.gh, and it says, Akufuadu keeps dreaming about me. That's uh, John Mahama speaking. Yeah. Many teachers lack competence in digital tools, not yeah. urges regular ICT training. Yeah. Um, Eastern region, family demands justice for man. 37 killed by mob after driver yeah. claimed he was a thief. Mm -hmm. And Ghana's economy is still fragile and weak. That's according to the I 
IFS, and we'll be speaking to the IFS today yeah. uh, here on the show. Right, right after Butalai Nusa brings us a yeah. course today, yeah. and we'll have a sit down with the IFS. Yeah. And also, Supreme Court cannot, by peer pressure, be cajoled into adopting in our sex. Mm. That's according to Justice Yoni Kulendi. Okay. Yeah. So, so Razak is still giving us something. Harry Soya, a former education hey, Harry minister. Harry Soya, Harry Soya. Soya. Yeah, Harry Soya. Harry so- hey. And then Gladys, you Gladys, Gladys Asma. Were you a Commonwealth? Yes, I was were a Commonwealth. Yeah, I was a Commonwealth. Were, well. were you part of those who did that to Harry Soya? <laughs> were you? Were you? No, I was not there. School? I was not in school then. I'm were sure I was in then? primary school then. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Harry yeah. Soya. Yeah. You remember that story? I remember. When there were, you know, demonstrations of students yeah. and all of that, Harry yeah. Soya went there. Yeah. And uh, Harry Soya. Yeah. No, we we'll sing about everybody. Harry Soya. Yeah, we we'll sing about everybody. Oh. We we'll sing about everybody. Come on, boy. Yeah. Try. <laughs> yeah, we we'll sing about everybody. <laughs> we we'll sing about everybody. Oh, Harry Soya. We we'll sing about Harry everybody. Do you know what I remember about Harry Soya? His goatee. Yes. <laughs> yes. Yes. And then there's Glad- Gladys Asma. Gladys Asma. And Akufo. Of Blessed Memory. Of Blessed Memory. She's the one yes, she's the one. Yeah, Gladys, Gladys, Gladys Asma. Asma. No, Christian yes. Church. Um, ap- apologies uh, yeah. to, to Christian Church. Uh, yeah, more life to her. More, more life, life to, to her. More life to her. May she live long. Yeah. May she prosper. Is um, is is um, 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 glad is asthma, right? Yeah, glad is asthma. Yeah. Um, and, and and of course, uh, Fred talks about Kwesi yeah. as well, former finance yeah, minister. Yeah, Professor Kwesi And then Muhammad Drisu. Kwesi yeah. committee. Yeah. <laughs> yes, yes, subsequently. <laughs> yep. Yes. So basically, uh, that is it. Oh, but you guys, you guys have forgotten. <laughs> <laughs> you know, well, you know, are you aware? Oh, yeah. Are you aware? <laughs> an interior minister resigned <laughs> as a result of the killing of the the overlord of. Dagbon. Oh, yes, yes, yes. Malik yes, yes. Yakubu. Yeah, yes, Malik Yakubu. Malik Yakubu, yeah, yeah. I remember. But what, what, became, what became of him after, after leaving office? It just, it just, just, uh, we don't know. I remember Malaysia. Yeah, yeah, Malaysia received it. Oh, yeah. the PNC man. Yeah, PNC man who joined the government. Who joined government Went traveled the national team. Came to tell us that 40,000. Travel with money. Money, yeah. Came to tell us that 40,000 or so dollars. Just 40,000. Yeah. And speaking of speaking of people who joined Kufo's uh, ministerial who were not uh, MPP people, Papa Kwesi Indu. Papa Kwesi Indu. Remember, he was a uh, minister for, um, I think he was minister for energy at a point. And then he became minister for public sector public reform. Public sector yeah. reform. Yeah, yeah, yeah that's yeah. that's what I remember him for most. Public sector reform. <laughs> yes. And then and 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 okay, so now he's just a businessman. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Now. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, wh- where's the PPP? Is he not the founder and leader of the PPP? Yeah, the I'm not sure the PPP the will put up. The Progressive People's Party. Yeah, is there if, Papa uh, in those PPP? on paper? Is there on paper? Yeah. But uh, now I think it's, it's aligns with everything opposition. So like, yeah, so it aligns with opposition. Everything yeah. opposition. Because Indum is busily touring his yeah, uh, yeah. facilities that have been overtaken by wheat and what have you. Uh, the GN Bank facilities, mm. right? So I'm not sure he will put himself up for uh, any political well, election. I, mean, uh, he, I think he paid a courtesy call on President John Mahama. Yes, and he said he has sent a letter to uh, the vice president also. He wants to meet the yeah. vice president. Mm, yes. Yeah. Mm, 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 mm. yeah. So okay. he's meeting everybody. Kwame <laughs> Pepra. Uh, uh, Yes, yeah. Kwame Pepra as well. Uh, Bartolomeo as uh, Kwame Pepra as well. So, like, yeah. hey, Charlie, <laughs> Kari, 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 Kari Kwashiga. <laughs> yes, of blessed memory. Yeah. Kari Kwashiga of blessed memory. Yes, yes, oh, yes, yes. That's yes. for yes. Kari Kwashiga. Yeah, I like that. Man. Yeah. I like that. Yeah. Major. There's, 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 Major a, story, there's, there's a story about him. Yeah. I don't know how true is it, but maybe mm. it's something we can discuss. Yeah. But it has to do with his role. When Rollins uh, took power, yes. what he also had to do to consolidate Rollins' oh, he was arrested of power. At the point Later, he was arrested, he fell yeah. off, yeah. he was arrested. Yeah. And all yeah. This, yeah. Yeah. I think yeah. It's even captured in um, Nao Tamal Kru's book, I yeah. think. Yeah. Never Say Die. Yeah. 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 Yes. And then, okay, so uh, feeling that he's saying that the most popular regional minister was Modestus Ahiamble, Volta regional minister. He was, always on, uh, the, uh, he was always on the news on GBC. Those days. Modestus. Modestus. You yeah. didn't need to add voter rejection. <laughs> it's a domestic. <laughs> <laughs> it can only be from voter rejection. Uh, it was also one time uh, bring average now minister, Jay Mensah. Uh, Jay Mensah. Yes, yes. Now, Abo. Uh, who was the, the no, one? Central region. That, that was the one. Edu Mazi. Edu Mazi. Edu Mazi. Edu Mazi. Edu Mazi. Yeah, yeah. Now, Abo. Now, Abo. Abo, though. Abo, though. Oh, Charlie, the throwback is really throwing back. And then, Magizu. 
to my gizzo, my, my gizzo, gizzo, yeah. My I gizzo, think later yeah. he became a chief. Yeah. After he left. Yeah. 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 This yeah. guy also became a man of God. I think someone knew him. I heard I you mention his name. Yes, the Ashanti yes, region. Yes. yes he became a man of God. Uh, Victor Salome. Yes. 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 Uh, yeah, Victor, Victor Salome as well. Yeah. yeah and Kwame um, Pepra was so Kwame powerful Pepra, yeah. and popular. Yeah. Very. <laughs> very. 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 And then a story is told about finally. Tew. The very first time I got to hear of Tew. DH Mensa. DH Mensa. Yes, of course. DH Mensa. Yes. DH Mensa. A story is told about Tew. Yeah. So Rollins, Chairman Rollins, but then traveled. And then two members decided to go on strike. <laughs> so when he came, he had to be briefed and debriefed, yeah. right? And so they tell him, well, a lot of things happened, blah, blah. And then Tehu also went on strike. Tehu went on strike. <laughs> tell him he's fired. <laughs> <laughs> tell Tehu he's fired. Uh, tell Tehu he's fired. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's a nice Thursday morning. Uh, you're still listening to The Morning Star. This is Star 103.5 FM, also live on Empire 102.7 FM in Takurade. Uh, doing a little bit of a throwback on this nice throwback Thursday. Uh, Mutalai Nusa is here in the studio and uh, we'll get to court today. Uh, much later on, uh, we have an interview with the uh, IFS. We'll be talking Ghana's economy and more. And of course, we have another interview with Professor Bafo Ajimandia. Uh, Professor Bafo Ajimandia will be joining us in the studio at 9 a.m. And we're going to have a conversation with him as well on uh, a number of issues, a wide range of issues that bother on governance and the governance of this country. Um, so uh, do stay tuned. When we return, Mutalai Nuza is here with the details from the courts. And then a whole lot more will come up. <laughs> 